Hello and welcome back everyone to Elden Ring. We made it last time all the way to Kalit and entered this mine, it seems. It's called the Gale Tunnel, interestingly. And uh, we died here against one of those giant octopus. But we have to get through here because otherwise there's no exit, it seems. So let's find our way through. But the good thing is, the good news here is that... Whoa. Uh, that there are plenty of... Good materials. Man. They hit hard. Remember that there was the the trumpet guy. Take care of this. All right. Feels like the game is a little bit louder than before. Maybe some of the audio settings change. Let me adjust that a little. Should be a little bit better now. But the back steps were incredibly loud, I felt. But maybe it was just me. They're always pretty loud, but not to this degree. Oops. All right, let's pick up all those cracked crystals. I'll have enough of those. Uh, so they seem to guard this little side cave where we last time died against the octopus. The giant one, not the small one. Point out. I leave anyone alive? I don't think so. So would be good heading in. Gotta get my runes up. There's the big boy. Uh, kind of thinking about how I want to do this here. Oh. Maybe I can't think too long about this. Pepper him with uh, some black flame. Oh, that actually stunned them. I'll get to know. Oh, I could. Uh, I did equip this new rock sling. Let's try it. Okay. Kind of like a quick. Almost like a dagger. Not oh, nice. I'll be a little more careful than last time. I underestimated. The octopus last time. Also, put on my light so I can actually see something. I don't like that sound. Right. Sombering smithing stone. Cross Nakitana. 
I'll check that out in a second. And smithing stones four, yeah. Those are the ones I'm mostly here for. Let's look at that cross Nagitana. That looked awesome. Where do we have this? Cross Nagitana. Piercing weapon. A uh, weapon consisting of three prong blade affixed to a long pole. The long central blade closely resembles a katana. A weapon of the land of reeds, known for its ability to be wielding as a spear while still being capable of performing slashing attacks. That actually does sound pretty good. Let me just have a look at it. Okay. Pretty cool moveset with both slashing and piercing. And you have a big pierce. That might be a nice secondary weapon to consider. We also consider the Bloodhound's Fang as a secondary weapon. We do have to get out of here to upgrade any weapons, so. That comes first. Uh, let's. Actually, fill up our FP. Was this a trap here? Probably. Oh yeah, there is one. Trumpet guy. Large glintstone scraps, okay. Have a grace mimic. Mm. Behind here. many runes do we have? Quite a few, actually. Oh no. Last time... Just... Stay calm. Alright. Okay. This looks like the boss arena. Ah. Uh. Esteemed warrior, where did you spring from? It's not Alexander, this is right? A dead end, I'm sure of it. What's going on here? A door from thin air. Well, stranger things happen at sea, or so I'm told. But onward to the Kalid Wilds. Ah, that dead end had me rather stumped. <laughs> it's time I set off to the festival. At Redmain Castle on the southern. No, that edge might be Alexander, Scarlet right? He he talked about the Redmain Castle. Doesn't the thought just set your heart a flutter? But he sounds different, I feel. It's time I set off to the fest. Doesn't the? Th or am I going crazy here? I mean, I may. Oh, we do have another out of grace. That's nice. Let's actually rest here then. The still there. I hear big, big sounds coming out of there. Let's see what we have. Let's see. Ooh, do we? Oh boy. Oh, whoa. That was so much damage. Whoa, he's doing so much damage. And we're doing not much damage.
Oh, yep. Kind of expected something like that. Oh, he also has a sword. Okay. Oh, there's Magma. He seems very strong for us right now, but... Did we, did we summon him? Did we get to summon him? I think so. Okay, that was it. Oh! Okay. Okay. This might be a tough one. <laughs> but I do want to give it a couple of tries. I don't know why he did that much damage to me. It's time I said the festival doesn't the Okay, uh let's drink Glass of Wondrous Physique, definitely. The Popper Room. Man, he hit so hard. an AOE, okay. He is very strong. Like maybe, oh, I had so many runes, I should pick them up. Maybe historically lightning against dragons works, but oh. that didn't work. Ooh. I'll take that. I wonder if those stones do good poise damage in general, or if we this was just if we hit a certain health threshold. When he hits, oh, I can't see anything. And we're surrounded by magma, so that's great. It was way too early there on my... I wanted to roll! It's late. Don't have his timing down. I'll show if you notice. <laughs> oh, ah, I wanted to get out of there, but too late. And now we're almost out of... Uh, no lock-on is the way to go. <sighs> Does he stop? 
apparently not. Apparently he's just... Yeah, I'm done. Yeah. This continues. Jesus Christ. That wasn't a bad try, though. We got him down to, like, one-third. I think they're... I think using the lightning early on to do a good chunk of damage makes sense. Um... Yeah, let's drink our... Wondrous Physique. It does good damage. Uh, I shouldn't obviously do that when he's... to breathe. So big in this fight. Still lava. Stay away from him a little bit. Okay. I missed my spot there. I don't want to be too greedy because if I attack too much, he'll do the AOE. Oh man. When he's crawling around like that, that's so. I didn't see him winding up. Ah, oh, that delayed attack. Top one. He is a tough one. Not unbeatable, though. I just gotta gotta, gotta get his move set down a little bit better. Um, I wanted to equip. Different. Let's, let's equip these marionette soldiers. Um. Other than that, we could obviously do some fire resistance, but I don't really feel like doing that in a mini boss fight. I think that. Good here. 
Honestly, it would be kind of nice to have an NPC summon. Wouldn't complain about that, but. That was some bullshit. I'm stuck. Oh, where are my roots? Oh, they're almost gone. I also didn't use my Basic Wonders for Z. I'm betting a thousand this one. from the AOE there. So the AOE doesn't seem to be as wide behind him, so that's good. Ooh, that was lucky. That was just luck, not skill. That insta kills me. That is. <sighs> that is brutal. That, my friends, is brutal. I feel like the summons are not really useful here. Kind of gone very quick. Um, let's use Flask of Wondrous Physique. Uh. Oh, man. I can't even attack him. Oh, they're. Both that now, just one. Now this one I avoided the swipe on purpose. This one, it was luck. Sometimes it's on luck, sometimes it's on purpose, you know? I'll be honest about that. Oh, this one I didn't even see that coming. Thought he was just turning around to marinate, bro. Uh. Where is he? Oh, come on. This Marinette bro is actually doing my solid better. Oh, I didn't didn't even see that I got hit the first time. That was a better. That was a better uh, attempt. I mean.
the issue is that the marionette soldiers die so quickly. So maybe I should summon them more when I'm in, so they're not like at the entrance immediately. They get hit. Looked like one got taken out pretty much immediately. Um, so, that's a wondrous physique. When he covers all the floor in lava like that, when he does the running around thing multiple times, it just makes it so tough. Actually, you know what? Let's see if we can get some help from the community. For once. In so far, success rate with that hasn't been great. Be honest, but yeah. ah, something incredible. Well. I don't know if I would call it incredible. We could always come back here, obviously. I just feel like he does so much damage on me. I could... Actually, now that I think about it, I could switch out this one for the fire one. Um... Uh, charge attacks, stamina reducing against blockers, horseback, low range, wars, damage nicking. Not that. The fire wall is, definitely makes sense. There is one. Let's see. Zipio. Unable to summon. I won't be waiting for too much longer here. This one. Another Sibia. Maybe the same Sibia. Okay, we have some co-op action. Let's do the friendly thing and Say hi. Hey! Oh, he actually says hi. Um, let's drink our flask of wondrous physique. Of a rune arc. Go all in on this one. Uh oh. I don't have the timing on that one. Let me grab my runes first. Let me go. Still got me. Damn it. That attack. And a big miss. That's exactly what you need in a boss fight. Whoa, he's like disappearing and shit. He has an old hunter's bow. Pull back. 
pull back off me. Want to play it safe. Having a distraction for him definitely helps. Just that the my ashes they didn't survive long enough. We can't get all it. Whoa! That is a new attack. That's a new attack. Didn't like the attack. Oh. Are you seeing the spinning, I think? Nope. Oh, he does do. Oh, what? He tricked me, though. That's something we got. He really tricked me. It was like, oh yeah, he's moving around like he does the spinny, but... Come on, one more. I hope Scipio still gets his XP. I think we might have killed him in time. Ooh, another Dragon Heart. And the Moon Veil Blade. We actually get to the entrance here. That is good. Okay, we have another dragon heart. That's awesome. Let's look at the moon veil. Look like a katana sword there. With an intelligence scaling. Masterpiece of uh, Salian Swordsmith. Bush of Glinster. Light and wreath the blade when sheathed, explaining its moon veil moniker. That is awesome. There's nothing here, right? Okay, thank you, uh, CPO. You definitely shortened this adventure. Oh, that yeah, helped. time I set off to the festival. Doesn't the thought just sit? Kind of. Now we can use that other thing to leave to uh, to the beginning of the cave, but I am curious as to where this leads. Oh no. It's outside. Oops. Oh, we're here. Oh, okay. Okay. I see. We do have quite a bit of souls, and we now have a bunch of upgrade materials, so... You want to stop by at the table of lost grace? Um. Let's go over here. Well, I'll to eat my mat. Lay out your own. So, we have 10 smithing stones. I think we can definitely go one more. We could upgrade the... Oh, this one needs sombering smithing stone, the Bloodhound Fang. And what about this one? That needs normal smithing stone. I think we can go this one with two for sure. The Bloodhound Fang does look good. I mean, it's more of a deck scaling, it seems. And I don't think we were able to... But like, we do have a decent amount of decks. Might be a nice secondary weapon, you know? I'm thinking about it. Like, the Sombering Smithing Stones obviously are a little bit more rare. Then again, if I never use them, then... 
what's the point of it anyway, right? <laughs> Oh and, oh, and they just take one for each tier. Well, that I can. That way we can upgrade another one if we wanted to. So this one, do 300 something, and it's something kind of similar, but like we have blood with this one and holy split damage with this okay nice having a secondary weapon can we do one level up not quite but almost um now that we use some runes to well i took you for no matter upgrade the weapon so let's sell a few rune I oh i can actually sell one of the dis dismounters as well Duplicate. Celestial Dew, I could sell, but I won't. Um, let's consume some of those smaller ones. That should give us the ability to level up one more time. Um, could go further into faith, could go further into strength, could go further into vitality, mind is always an option too, endurance, endurance I feel like maybe not, so let's go, I think we go further into faith, um, all right. Then, there was another Cathedral of Dragon Communion. But I don't think we need to go there just now, because we, I think there were multiple items with uh, that we only could get with multiple Dragon Hearts anyway. So I think returning here to the smoldering church and then going there. Another thing that we could do is kind of check out but south. Right? Like that is an option to consider. Kind of going this way. Um That would be an option. I I think I want to check out this earth tree first, this minor earth tree. There's just so many paths to go. So, in here. It was a fun fight against the worm, and I probably, I mean, probably eventually I would have beaten him on my own. It should, whoa, that's the biggest jar I've ever seen. Um, eventually I would have beat him on my own. It, it was just that I think we were a little underpowered for this, this fight, and I didn't really want to come back to that cave, but at the same time also didn't want to spend an entire episode just with a fight, you know? But we gave it a few good shots, came close-ish a couple of times. Oh, oh I thought he was, he was gone. Okay, we have this minor urge. I, I see the biggest jar in the entire world. Probably shouldn't mess around here. Oops. 
This gold mask, like, there are a ton of them. Also, they will probably be a easier to fight on foot, honestly, but... Convinced me. There's a dude upstairs. Can I get him? Right now. Hey! These Marinette soldiers, they're pretty nice. I feel like Shelly Bro still has some sentimental. Ooh. Whoa! Uh. Hello, good sir. Archie Avatar! Oh, he did good damage there. Oh. Uh, soldiers? I saw what he was doing. Took me just too long, too. That black flame did a bunch of damage. And yeah, maybe I should actually not just stand there. Like, where are my marionette soldiers all of a sudden? Are they dead? I don't want to die here because I feel like I... Oh, I can't see anything. I can't see anything! Okay, I thought... I, I fought very stupidly in this fight. Like, that was all on me. I think the issue was that I honestly didn't think that he was too s not that strong. Oh. Did they aggro the ones behind me? Of course they did. That is not what I wanted either. Like how can I maybe not do bad things? Like why am I? I just need to fight him normally. Stop messing around here. A goober. Don't want to be a goober. I'm fighting like a goober. Why? So many stupid mistakes. What is this? What is this? Oh, why am I basically dead? It's very stray demon here. Oh. Oh. oh, that also does damage. Okay. Okay. Maybe he's not as easy as I thought. I'm just straight up underestimating this dude when he's a boss. But you, something you shouldn't really do in a Souls game. Let me tell you. So, 
Let's focus here. Let's use our class of wondrous physique. Let's also we have some I don't have any fight. That's unfortunate. Uh, really unfortunate. I really would have liked that. So, nice. That was great. Now. Full charge black flame does hell of damage. Too aggressive there. Again, these delayed attacks. The bane of my existence. Still hit me. I couldn't. Ah, uh, these stupid jars. I feel like that was better. Just the. Uh, Let's stuck on the jars. We almost got him there. Still a few easy mistakes. That black flame is nice. It just takes so much time to charge up. Other than that, that was much better. I do like at least the temporary distraction that we get. These dudes. So that was good. Yeah, let's stay away. Right, just again, the doors. These stupid jars. Okay. I think that was much better though. Walk a few few steps in some of the Marinette soldiers, so he's occupied with them. I can spam in some of the black flame. Um which does a ton of damage, and then we'll we'll fight him pretty much one on one. Marinette soldiers. Let's go around him. I'm still alive. Okay. 
mean, he hits like a truck. That's the thing. Oh no. And this one has like just an insane reach, so. Doing the stanky thing again. Stanky boy. Thank you, boy. Ooh. And that's thank you, boy. I'm a little bit far behind. I don't... That's new, kind of. Oh no, it, that wasn't new. Stanky boy? Don't think I have anything here, but. Couldn't really see anything there. They're just blocked. the block button but not well oh no oh no ah it, that was completely brain fart on my part there at the end i pressed for some reason the block and roll button at the same time and I think then I did neither. <laughs> so, that was on me. Almost had him. Felt like I had his uh, move set down, though. Big thing just is controlling the arena or the area I don't know don't have my weapon equipped stanky boy when he does this so you don't run into the jars or too far back to get like the oh, that is not a good place to be in yep that might be it uh You know, again, like I said, controlling the arena. I was kind of stuck in this area. Then got hit by the last holy beam. But again, like I feel like I have him down. I'm just making a stupid mistake in these last two attempts. So I just need to stop, make uh, stupid mistakes. Not that easy. Almost. That opening with a black flame, though, that's pretty good. And that also mostly goes towards. This might be rot, scarlet rot, right? Uh, 
Yeah, I'm completely stuck here. Again, arena control. Sneak. Ah, uh, they send you with the sneak. Uh, completely missed the timing there. The double heal. And he does the stank again. Jeez. He grows. Uh, the stank got me. I'm sneaking again. Again the stain, Jesus Christ. Stop with the stain, or burn you. I told him, stop it with a stang or a burn. Didn't want to listen. Green burst, crystal tear, flame shrouding, crack tear. So we got some options for our flask of wondrous physique. Uh, Okay, we have some tomb here. Minor urn tree catacombs. Right. Now let's check out what those tears do. So this is dexterity. Boost stamina recovery speed. That's usually good. Can be mixed. Okay. Very boost fire attacks. Okay. So, actually, I think I will mix in the stamina recovery instead of the dexterity for now. And before we explore these catacombs, I want to see if we can get to the big old jar there. Um, I hope that he's friendly. Can we even get there? Oh, look at that. Whatever that is, that's a big bow. That's a big jar. A little bit jarring. Uh, yeah, so this might be actually it here in this corner. Oh, there is an item up there. Crack pot. That, that looks like another giant arena. We saw one of the those close to Stormvale Castle. Okay. Well. Got a couple of boss fights in today. I uh, think we will probably take a break here and then head into the catacombs. Because they are always fun. How, much, how many runes did we get? Okay. A few. Alright. 
uh, I think this is where we will take a break and then continue next time. Thank you all for joining me for today's episode of Elden Ring. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give the video a like. Maybe consider subscribing to the channel. Share the video with friends, family, and the people on the internet. It all helps me out a whole bunch and will bring you more content in the future. I will be back with more Elden Ring very soon. Until then, have a great time.